Hey guys, it's Jenga. Um, long time no see. I just got my Fandom Flakies box for January. Let's see what I got. This month, um, I ordered not only the polishes, but um, the rivet stick -its, acetone additive, and um, it's a little smaller than what I thought it was going to be, but I guess it didn't take much of this to work. Um, and if you don't know what acetone additive is, which I, I'm sure most of you do, um, acetone is really harsh and, you know, it dries out your nail, the skin around it. You can put this in your acetone and um, it makes it um, really moisturizing so that the acetone isn't really harsh and I need that because I am definitely a person that I cannot have acetone on my natural nails like at all so even the cleanup around it you know this will be great but let's unwrap everything okay um here's the acetone additive by ribbit stick it and um it's called they call it their um frogettable acetone additive it's in the scent of my hometown and um it's kind of a like a soft perfumey kind of smell but floral with it it's really soft and pretty and um i think i'm gonna really like it i generally gravitate toward the fruity smells um but i really like this so and i'm i'm sure it works great and then the polishes. <laughs> um, I cannot remember at all what the theme was on this box, but um, I'll try to link it in the description box if I can figure it out. Um, but here's a Bee's Knees Lacquer, Double Trouble. And it is beautiful. Um, look at all those teeny weeny little micro glitters and flakies. And it is just, it's a party in a bottle. Beautiful. Um, and then the Night Owl Lacquer. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, that is so, look, look the sun is coming through. Look at that. Bam beautiful um, fire saga and um, I love the way that you know the makers kind of, you know they collaborate I guess on these and even though they're so different they're similar you know you can see the little micro flaky hollow thingies <laughs> yeah just really beautiful they really brought it on the I knew when I saw this box I had to have it and here's one of the main reasons why quick sodic polish was um, a guest maker and I love quick sodic polish you cannot go wrong if you've never tried them try it great polish and this one is Spjorg note and look at that just oh, gorgeous i'm thinking that's all flaky in there just they look at that look right here in the sun isn't that beautiful oh, beautiful polish um so i'll be right so um i got a new hand and i haven't really used her like at all since i bought her she's probably dirty um but I wanted, you know, everybody names their hand, and um, I wanted a special name for my girl here. Um, I've had a lot of family members pass away um, from 2014 up to now. I've had three sisters pass away since beginning in 2014 up to now, and my baby sister was, you know one of them and it's been really hard but with god's help and mercy you know i'm making making it through it 
but I thought, you know, I'm gonna name this hand and um, name her after my three sisters. So Bridget was the baby and then um, there's Brenda and Barbara. So Brenda's middle name is Lee, Barbara's middle name is Ann. Bridget doesn't have a middle name, so I named my hand Bridget Leanne after my beautiful sisters. Um, and I really miss you guys, you girls. <laughs> but I'm gonna do something different. I'm gonna try to swatch on um, Bridget Leanne. So bear with me. Double trouble. Bees knees like her. Guys, forgive me if I'm not in frame too much. <laughs> I will try my best. This is such a beautiful, beautiful polish. I hope you all can see my lighting's off today. Well, it usually is because I film at the wrong time of the day. Okay, then we're going to do the Night Owl Lacquer um, Fire Saga. I sure hope that I can do this in frame. I hope everyone's doing well. If you got anything you want to talk about or just tell me how your day's going, I'd love to hear about it. If you're excited about anything up and coming in your life, let me know. Let me celebrate with you. I sure do love and care about you guys and um on and off i've been getting new subscribers and i just want you guys to know how that just tickles me to death um sorry guys we're on quixotics bjork note yeah it makes me so happy um so yeah just if you're new here welcome um, please, if you <laughs> like this train wreck that is me, uh, hit the like button, subscribe. Oh, I didn't expect this to be blue. It been, you know, I forget when I first order these, I, I, I just forget. <laughs> do you guys do that? Like by the time you finally get your orders, you're like, oh yeah, that's right. That's why I love that polish. Okay, so um, I'm going to do um, a couple more coats because I'm sure these will need at least, well, I don't know. I'm going to do at least one more coat off and I'll be back. Okay, guys, um, here they are. Um, I just did two coats on the um, Bee's Knees Lacquer. Um, I just thought you could see it better. But that is two coats. Oh, my hand is going crazy. And um, a glossy top coat. And for the glossy top coat, um, I used um, Sassy Cat's Lacquer. Um, I love her top coats. And um, they, most of them, you can get them scented. And this is Everlasting Gobstopper. Um, I don't think you can get the scent because this was, I think, from either PPU or Hella Handmade. Um, can't quite remember but anyway that was two coats of double trouble bees knees lacquer well then I have two coats of um, night owl lacquer fire saga I, beautiful this one oh it's just beautiful in the sun they're all beautiful but it's just gorgeous. Um, 
then this is the quixotic and look at that I hate to keep saying beautiful but I mean what else is there gorgeous outstanding um, but this is Bjorg note and then I kind of just put um, a little of each of them this is the bees knees the night owl and um, quixotic sporg notes your note and uh, I put a matte top coat on that and I'll try to zoom in a little bit but that's it look at this Bjorg note with the matte top coat look at those flakies but that's gorgeous and I used um, cuticulas Cuticulas um, cloud cover matte top coat, and this one is actually scented and sugar coated. And I believe I'm thinking this one was actually from PPU, so I don't know if you can get that scent, but it's great. Um, anyway, so a little bit of a struggle trying to get used to using um, Bridget Leanne in some of my videos, but. I wanted um, one of these hands for ever so long and then I got it and I kind of shied away from using it and so yeah I want to use her but anyway that's my um, January Fandom Flakies box and I'm hoping um, to have my January um, Polish pickup video up as soon as I get it in the mail. Um, are you guys experiencing like an extra super duper long time on your um, Polish pickup orders? I mean used to be it didn't take so long uh, Let me know Oh, yeah, and I don't want to forget um, also the rivet stick it um, forget about it i think i said forgettable or something earlier i don't know what it's called forget about it acetone additive in my hometown but anyway um i hope all is well and um if you've not picked up a fandom flakies box you don't know what you're missing um i got the three polishes and um, they're usually um, you always get the bee's knees and a night owl, and then they have a guest maker. Um, and then, you know, sometimes they'll have extras, you know, besides. And um, so we had Quixotic and Ribbit Stickets this month. And uh, I think I paid, um, well, I can actually tell you, it was, um, the acetone additive was only three seventy five, so... You know that's not bad i said the bottle was smaller than i thought but i mean for 375 but anyways that's my fandom flakies uh, for january i love you guys be safe um go out and find a sale and get yourself something good bye